there still seems to be this indecision that is in your guys' um, relationship. But with this eclipse, this is the backside of the moon card. With this eclipse that we just went through, it has pushed this indecision to um, the ending or the disruption or the the um, emotional upheaval to to happen in their life, creating um, the opportunity to come out the other side, um, coming through this death process, reborn, ready to start a new cycle with putting this Ten of Swords aside, once again, the eclipse of the um, sun there. So with all these eclipses, um, most definitely it's bringing in reunions. Um, you do have the Temperance and the Four of Wands. What has to be done in order to um, bring the connection together and with the the uh, winged wise ones being in your current energy, this is um, the miraculous aid of angels. Your um, angels, your spirit guides, they are all working in your favor. This is saying as if by magic, this connection is going to appear. Your advice is to stay optimistic and to go with the flow. And with that, um, will bring you the outcome you desire because currently they're going through this resurrection and you're going through the lady in the mirror. So that with with all those combined, um, the connection is able to come together as long as you follow, you know, the advice that spirit is is leading you to follow your intuition. Um, so there's a lot of movement here. Uh, the next spread, we will uh, do what spirit sees that we do not. Specific messages for you and final outcome. So absolutely amazing. For some of you, um, as long as you are have completed what the advice was and continue to put in that work um, in those areas that were um, brought to light um, in that first spread, some of you within the next two weeks are coming into full reunion. Some of you in the next couple months, um, in the time of Scorpio, I'm seeing for some of you, but, uh, yeah, this is, this is pretty specific about what, th where this path is leading. So, so excited for you guys.